one of the things that I've learned is that raw intellectual horsepower mm -hmm. is nowhere near as val valuable as clarity of thought. Mm -hmm. um, and so what you're really looking for is clarity, the ability to communicate that, uh, the ability to take in disparate ideas, process them, process challenging questions, uh, and do it in a way that's not arrogant, uh, but that's respectful of trying to find the truth. Um, and it's that intellectual uh, integrity that we think is so important. One of the ways we get at it is uh, we ask people oftentimes what they're most insecure about, um, mm -hmm. which is a funny question to ask mm -hmm. in a fundraising circumstance or in a job interview. But what happens when you ask that question is that people are forced to decide if they're going to uh, present themselves as vulnerable uh, in that moment. Mm -hmm. uh, and what I found is that when you're dealing with the early stage companies, or, or really if, if you're in a big company and you make a mistake and you hide it, uh, six months later it blows up and it's really embarrassing. Uh, if you're in a small company and you hide it, six months later it blows up and it can be fatal. Mm -hmm. And what you want- or Six days later. Uh, right. Anytime, right? Mm -hmm. And what you want on the team are people who are very introspective, understand their strengths and weaknesses, uh, know where they have opportunities to grow, um, and who are not afraid to ask for help, right? To raise their hand and say, oh, I screwed up, somebody come help me. Because the great thing about early stage businesses, there's tremendous camaraderie and people will flood in to solve the problem and support the team. Um, and what I found is that if people sit there and tell you, well, I really am not insecure about anything, it's, it's one of the clearest indicators that this is not somebody who's going to be a good cultural fit um, for an early stage company. You know, a lot of people will use the metaphor of a foxhole. Um, mm -hmm. And if you're in the foxhole fighting it out, a grenade rolls in, right? You want the person with the best arm picking it up, not the person who wants to prove that they have the best arm to throw that grenade out. And, and so, you know, going to the places where people are forced to be vulnerable and be vulnerable in a way that's authentic um, tells you a lot about somebody's character.